again, I mean, we're stuck with an old organizational model. If you look at the corporation as as model, is that uh, 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 officers in a corporation have have one responsibility? They they have fiduciary responsibility, as they call it, and their responsibility is to enhance profit. And they can actually go to jail if they don't maximize profit for the corporation. That's their job, right? Uh, now, in some states in America, like California, they're experimenting with the B corporation. And the B corporation is allowed to have two bottom lines, right? Is allowed to have, okay, maximization of profit, but they can also have another bottom line, which could be do, do environmental good. Right, and that lot, or um, uh, um, uh, support the commu- the community could be could could be a, a, another thing, and then um, by by law and by the structure and the regulations is that decisions can be okay. This is not the most profitable, but it aligns with our second uh, uh, mandate that we have, and I think that that. Again, I think we need to create new types of structures, and there are a lot of people who are talking about different types of structures. Whether it's um, uh, you know these uh, uh, crowdsource funding, where you uh, uh, peer-to-peer networks, uh, shareable types of organizations, and people, and I think we're seeing this really interesting experimentation going on in organizational structure, organizational mandate, how things run. Uh, because when you, you, know, you take a look at it is that, you know, the, you know, how corporations run, we take for granted, you know, that, um, uh, well, of course it has to make money. Well, yeah, that's because that's the law, and that's the structure. But, but, all, but all of this is artificially created. <laughs> it just takes a while for people to change their, 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 their major mental models. Um, folks like, I don't know if you're familiar, familiar with the Beta Codex um, uh, folks, you know, and, and they've come up with, I think, probably the most detailed model on how organizations can work in, this, in a hyper-networked uh, economy. Um, but, I'm, but they're not the only ones. Everyone is trying to grapple with this problem.